What's up, YouTube? This is Savaslegna23, and I am joined today by Gilbert, and we're not going to be racing or anything. We're just going to be sitting here playing a thing called Yokai Watch 2 Spirit Specters. Psychic, Psychic Specters. Specters. Yep. <laughs> and there you go. We're just going to be starting up a new game, and, well, if you had expected to, uh, be full into the story, then I do apologize greatly, as I know that, although there will be some stuff that I will sit and read because I forget about it, for the most part we're going to be skipping a lot of the, uh, the story of the game. Also, there's going the story might use more cheats, it's up to him. The only one that I'm going to be using immediately will be the one that allows me to have full access to as much crank kai as I want. Meaning that I am able to crank it as many times as I want without restrictions to the five-day rule. No, and that's what changes depending on, like, what quest, what chapter of the game you're on. Yeah, but and the first time be... that we'll be able to access them, it's only five. Okay. Because, like, I do still plan to use all of the, uh, the codes to get us the, the free stuff. Because those are all stuff that the developers implemented into the game that's technically free game to use without it being cheating. Skip an event so that we can proceed. Now, personally, I'm going to be aiming for a QB down the line, so when we finally get to the part where we get to the donuts that allow us to select uh, which side of spirits we'll be getting. Which is right here. Definitely going for those soul donuts. You know QB is a post game, yo Kai, right? Doesn't matter. Okay. Just thought it might be good to tell you. Sad with mom. Soul donuts are better. Now I know they took the time to implement the whole street sign thing. I don't care. Probably end up fighting the jerk who sits here and spawns several times as I go about things because I don't care about traffic laws. Yeah. Bug net. Duff to the park. Why so quiet, friend? Oh, sorry. Sorry, I'm quiet. Didn't mean to be. It's fine, I was just curious. Okay. 
just that. <laughs> I'm sort of like focusing on the game right now. Okay, just got to the donuts. Putting spirit donuts. Catching some random bugs. Because we have to. Of course, you're forced to catch at least three. No, you just have to waste all of the like I did. Syrup. I did. Well, other I... than that, you have to like it. Like you just have to look at all of the places. That's it for catching bugs. Don't care about the critter collector. Let's get some of the fun stuff. Finally getting the yokai watch. Talking to Mr. Knickknack. Okay, we are ahead. Well, I've been skipping the scenes. As I admitted I that I was too. gonna. But, I don't like, know how I'm so far ahead of you. Uh, like you. Ah. <laughs> Forgot about something. And we now have Whisper in the party. Whisper is an actual party member. Yeah, but he's there. He's there as moles, but... Yeah, more comedic relief. Than even moral support. He's mostly just comedic relief. And you know it's true. Learn how to work the yoke of Rita. There's my little kitty pal who's going to be with me throughout most of this journey. I say most because I don't know if he's actually going to be on the final team because I know very little about Yokai Watch. Well, Jabanian gets better once you get into like level 50. Yeah, we'll just have to see though. Yeah, you might find a better Yokai by that point. It just depends upon what the crank guy gives us later. Just like I think I'm going to take Tattletail with the five star coin. You mean the Sletcher coin? Yeah, that thing. Just because last time I got a, I got a lot of good attackers, but like, well, Shadow Venner is a good healer if you can get, if you can actually upgrade his technique. Shadow Venner can be a really good healer if you upgrade his tech, because like his technique is like Paradise, which heals the Pokemon. I mean not. Pokemon. So I <laughs> go tie. Yeah. Just 
guy's a little jerk. Come on, put a shogun. Just, just. Friggin. Yeah. This is the same thing that held me up forever when we were doing it before. This friggin' jerk. All right. Brashito. We don't need the whole overpowered and unique summoning. Treatment. Yep, teaching us about how to fight. Power of the Sultimate. Banyan crush and everything. And now, Brashido has joined us, and no, I will not nickname him. At least not this time. It's time to make our first save of the game. Oh, and as we, we go on, you'll actually get to see some of my uh, first-hand reactions to things. Because I have not beaten this game yet. I don't even think I've gotten halfway through it yet. No, not really. Teaching me about healing. About buying stuff at the store. Oh no, I got the medallion twice. I got two medallions. Where'd you find medallions at? You get them after your first battle. Not one, not them, but one. Get yeah, one after your first battle. Oh yeah. Duh. My brain re was thinking that I was trying to turn medallions into a. Uh, into something else. Uh. Into Kraken Kai coins. That's why my brain was like, wait, where'd you find those? Blockade. It's fine. While you guard, I can build up Jabanyan's almighty sultimate. So that way I can wreck your face. Yep. 
Oh yeah. Gotta leave rice ball. I did not persuade him. I beat his ass, which forced him to move. Because he didn't have any other choice. Hello, Ipo. Probably one of my favorite things in the game. I don't know why, saving out this little eye. It just feels... It feels nice. It feels right. One of the two only selector coins you can ever get in this game. You only get the second one. Actually, no, you can get like four. But like, you only get like the second and through fourth by playing your Tower Watch one. Yeah. A game of which I do have on here, I just haven't played through it to the point to be able to get those. I would really only recommend getting your, playing Yota Watch 1 through to like get the Slacker coin once and then get Tomasan. I don't know. Help, but the Frankakai has been added. Now let's take a look at Tattletale because I actually know nothing about this character and I want to learn a little bit more. Yes, I am going to swap you and Jabanya in places so you can heal both of the guys as we go about things. This is the whole point. Oh of no, you. that's not how that works. No, her her skill is caring. Gradually recover HP of adjacent yokai. Which means the yokai right next to her. So if I put her in the middle, yeah. then that means she'll recover Broshido and Jibanyan. Oh. Okay, that's what you're talking about. I thought you were talking about her tech. No. Which is Thor. Which also heals hell. Yep. Her technique restore. 50 power. Which means it's not a weak heal by any means. So, yeah, we got a decent healer on our team for now. There are others that are better. I have seen a couple of them. Learn about the different uh, quests and quest types. Catch this guy, Cicada. There are some insects that require uh, you successfully doing the minigame twice. Yes. That's new to me. 
I just saw a couple other bugs on the tree. I was like, you know what? Let's catch these just for the hell of it. Since they're right here. And then it's just like, eh, the first one was normal. I just failed. And hooray for stat upgrades. Bonus scene. Alright. Good ending. Could have also gone poorly. You know, there's three versions of every bonus scene. There's a boo, there's a bingo, and then there's a jackpot. Huh. I've only managed uh, bingos and boos. So yeah, far. Yeah, jackpots are pretty rare. As they should be. And this is a chest. Ten cent gum. Light heal item. Not bad. Start with quest number two. Yes, we take on the request. All right. Find these crazy little dudes. Reveal them from their hidey place. There we go. Finally skip the event. Let's just, just let us beat them up. We can be on our way. Yeah. yeah. Japania. If I can learn how to frickin' trace. Right. Wreck them all with Paws of Fury. <gasps> yeah. All right. Get some milk beating them up. Yeah, but how to befriend Yokai? You finally know that now. Which means we can actually do it. And that is key quest number two complete. And I will take the upgrade in speed for the downgrade in spirits. Ooh, another bonus scene. Bingo! Ah, oh, yeah. Ah, all it gave me was nasty medicine. Yeah, everything okay, story? Mm -hmm. 
Sorry, I'm not talking. What to say, um, stem them. That'll come in handy later. Now, I believe it's this store over here, actually, that we need to go to for the third one. Yes. All right. I didn't mean to say no. I'm sorry. Well, story, after I finish up this uh, key quest, how about we call it for tonight? Sure. And we can always do more of this either tomorrow or Saturday mm -hmm. when you are more active. Yeah. Quizzes is... can't remember if it's 1G or 2. 1G. <laughs> I said that after I put it in. Forgetting yeah. that I could just kind of ask the current yokai expert that's here with me today. Yeah, I'm getting kind of tired. Well, I'm almost done. I just gotta go befriend Hungramps and drag him over to the shop. Wait, didn't they want us to check in the store? Forget where all they t tell us to go. All I know is that at the end of the day, we have to head home. Why? Because convenient plot strikes. If you're also able to read this, it, they actually acknowledge the fact that this is awfully convenient that there's one here in your house just for you to come get. Mm -hmm. They are sometimes self-aware like that. Yeah, it, it's not to the point where it's, like, obnoxious either. Yeah. It's not like the Deadpool game where, like, every other second is trying to remind you, oh, this is a video game. You know? Yeah. There, there, there's actually quite a few games that are overly self-aware, even though they don't need to be. Mm. Alright. Now we have Hungramps. Meaning we actually have two healers on the team. Because he is capable of light healing, although he's not the best healer. But 
he he works if you don't have one. Yeah. Thought I did. Oh. Okay. For some reason, it just wasn't letting me interact with the the circle immediately. Well, I'm going to save right here, Paul and I. All right, I'm almost done. Just gotta skip a couple more events, and then I've completed all the key quests. Yeah. All right, key quest complete, and so we save here. Yeah. And isn't it after this that we're able to, short, very shortly after this, that we're able to go and use all the co all the card stuff, all the yeah. Uh... Yeah, after like this. After that chapter, we get to do passwords and QR codes. Alright, so... I won't bore you with seeing all the QR code stuff. I'll just... Kinda... Cut it out. And... We'll advance on. Um, so... Thank you everybody so much for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, subscribe. Ring the bell so you don't miss anything. If you didn't like, let me know why. And please try to let it be some kind of helpful criticism as opposed to just, I hate the game. Because that doesn't do anything for anyone. Mm -hmm. Anyway, until next time everybody, I'm out.